Well, another episode of Jay Leno's Garage. Today we're going to talk about tools. You know, uh, we like new tools, different tools, and there are always people inventing new tools, especially here in America. And they're using them, usually they're small companies, they're not big companies, like this one here, the Make Sense Tap Adapter. Elliot Evans owns this company. Elliot, come on in here. Now, you Thank sent me a couple of these, and I uh, had the guys try them out, and we, they, they were terrific. Uh, what Are you in the tool business? Uh, I got a machine shop, right. and I always wanted to start a manufacturing business, so, and that's why I started, started making some of these tools. Right, very cool, very cool. So tell me uh, how you came up with this idea. I came up with the idea of working on something one day, and it's just like, there's got to be a better way. Right. It's like, I didn't want to spend four hours tearing something apart when I just had to clean up these threads and there's no wrench that fits the back of a tap. Right. So I tried using a Crescent wrench, didn't work, or a vice grip. So I figured, then I came up with the idea of this tap adapter, which you just slip on the tap, right. and then it just changes it to a common nominal size, so you can just use a standard wrench. Okay, so you just take the set screw off. And so you slip that, okay, you just slip it over your standard tap. Yeah, right, right. Okay. Yep, yep. Very cool, and then, oh, let's see, and then tighten it on, and then you can use a normal wrench to do it, okay. Yep. And where's your company located? Uh, in Joyce, Iowa. Okay, so it's an American company? American company. Everything's made in America? Everything's okay. made right in America, yeah, Very right cool. in my little shop. So, you, so this is pretty much, a, is it a one-man operation? How many guys you got? I just got three guys. Three guys, yep. okay, yep. there you go. Yep. Oh, cool, so you do all this stuff yourself? Yeah. Well, that's fascinating. Uh, show me some of the things you have here. These, these are really, it's really clever. Explain what yeah, you have here. Yeah, what I got here is just another example of, uh, you could pretend this is a big motor or a heavy equipment or, right. or antique car. And let's say there's a bolt here that you, you got to take off or loosen, mm -hmm. but it's the same thing there. If you don't want to spend four hours tearing the rest of it apart, right? Because because your standard uh, ratchet extension doesn't fit in there, right. you can't touch it. And then if you put on the next one. It's too short. Too short. And you still can't reach it. Yeah, like kind of like Goldilocks. One is too hot, one is too <laughs> you cold. Yeah. You got to hold the, the porridge. What are you going to do? So then you just slip this one in and make sense socket extension, put it on there, and you can just take your common wrench, and now yeah. you can get it loose. You can go any spot on there. Well, you know, it's so simple. Why didn't I think of it? But see, now you can't get this out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How do we get There we go. So very cool, I see. So that, you know, it, 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 it just seems like a clever, so you machine all these. Yep. Very yep. good, very good, okay. Yep. Uh, but the tap adapter is really what I find fascinating. So obviously you have it to fit. Do you make the taps as well, or you buy those from someone else? Uh, I just let, usually everybody has their own taps. Right, right. So I just let everybody have the taps right. that and they then, have now. And then these just fit right over whatever yep. size you have. Yeah, and if you want to leave them in your stand like we right. do in our bench and they're okay, all there. Okay, so, oh, I see, so you just, these ones, you've left them all on. Right, so, okay. right. Okay, very cool. And how can, if they want to get in touch and buy these, how do they do it? Yeah, you can go to uh, l8inc.com or you can go to uh, Make Sense Tap Adapter, Google that, right. and then you can find our webpage. And how are these doing? How many have you sold so far? Uh, biggest problem, nobody sees my webpage. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I haven't sold very many. I probably sold 100 sets. Okay, yeah. well hopefully people will buy it now yeah, because yeah. we'll get you out on the website. A lot of people come to this website. See, it doesn't sound like a real exciting website to go to. You know, so you, stand, you have to liven it up a little okay. bit. That's why I put Lamborghinis and stuff on, so it gets people to look at the cool stuff like this. Because this is the stuff I like. I just like the fact that there are guys like him squirreled away in Iowa inventing new tools. And it, it, it's fun to see. We always think stuff comes from the Japanese or from China or from Germany. Whereas you got guys like him sitting back there, you know, coming up with these ideas, coming up with ideas like this. Very clever. He sent me some through the mail. And uh, I was so impressed. He said, come on out here and we'll do this. So that's why he's here. Thank you very yep, much. Thank you. There you go. That's, why didn't I think of this?